Well, it's amazing to have uh, so many people come out and uh, spend time with me, our, our team, and also the whole UMass family here at the uh, the Campus Center Hotel, which is a fantastic venue. And uh, to see the support that we have for me and the program is just a testament to all our great UMass fans out there. And uh, we're looking forward to building this thing into one of the top uh, programs in the country. And um, I really enjoy the, the process and have a good time doing it. He's been uh, unbelievable for me for the two years that I've been here. Uh, one of the all-time leading scorers in UMass history and, and a guy that I consider now one of the faces of our UMass program. I always say that I always thought Lou Rowe was the face of UMass and now you can put Ricky Harris, uh, I guess his face and maybe Lou's body is kind of the, the figure for UMass men's basketball. Uh, two guys that have done un amazing things here, done it the right way and, and Ricky's a guy who will graduate in four years and uh, has been a true uh, ambassador for the program and an unbelievable young man, person, and player to coach. But this will be the first uh, time that we'll have a full team that I can work with through the spring. They'll uh, be able to be up here for uh, class and also some training uh, in the weight room and conditioning over the summer. And really we have a group that now knows what it means to be my style of UMass men's basketball. And I'm, I'm really liking the way that they're competing right now, that they're taking care of business in the classroom and on the court, and also the weight room. I think that's a, a huge area for us to get better. And I'm uh, really just excited and, and have a huge amount of energy to get this program where I think it should and will be. Game today, I actually watched the senior night game, and it brought back memories and uh, all the fun times I had here at UMass over the past four years. I'm going to miss it, but I feel as though I did a great job here. Um, the fans were great here, and I appreciate all the love and support I got while I was here. Uh, I have a, a couple pre-draft workouts um, scheduled. Uh, depending on how I do there, hopefully I get an invite to the summer league in Vegas. But um, I just want to play basketball, man. Wherever God puts me and he, wherever he wants me to be, I'm playing basketball, I'm going to be happy and I'm going to make the best of it. Uh, can you talk about the future at UMass here? You played with a lot of young guys this year. Do they have the talent to kind of make a difference in the next couple of years here, you think? Um, I think they have a great team this upcoming season. Um, as you can see, during our last 10 games of the season, those guys started to mature. They started to get better. And I hopefully, and hopefully they can carry it over into next year and um, in years to come and show the, other, the, young, the younger guys that come in after them what it takes to be a good basketball player here at UMass. And, I know the sky's the limit for this team. If they work hard, they can do a lot of good things next year. Um, I think they have a great team this upcoming season. Um, as you can see, during our last 10 games of the season, those guys started to mature. They started to get better. And I hopefully, and hopefully they can carry it over into next year and um, in years to come and show the, other, the, young, the younger guys that come in after them what it takes to be a good basketball player here at UMass. And I know the sky's the limit for this team. If they work hard, they can do a lot of good things next year.